Hey guys, it's Jill. So I'm here outside of BJ's Wholesale Club in Orlando. Now, I was just here a few days ago, but my mother called me up and said, hey, they're giving away a free turkey if you spend $150. Now, let's be frank. My mother could spend $150 in her sleep without anybody's help, but she'd rather go shopping with me than my father. Who could blame her? So I needed a few things anyway. It doesn't matter that my mother has a turkey in her deep freeze. We're going to go see what we need to fill the cart with to hit $150, probably double by the time we're done. But we'll have some fun with it, and it's Thanksgiving shopping. So I will show you everything that we buy as we go along. Okay, first stop the Cuban rolls so that we can make some nice heroes because they have a fresh deli section. Here we go. Into the cart, item number one. My kids like little bites, but they prefer the fudge brownie ones, which they don't have. Okay, that doesn't help. We still have plenty of leftover Halloween candy, so I don't need any of that right now. Oh. But if anyone is interested for Christmas or this season, they have the hot chocolate bombs. I think that's a little bit too sweet for me. I like sweet, but I don't like uber sweet. But the packaging is cute. We're going to head down to the deli section and see if they have the cracked pepper turkey that we like. Ah, for everyone getting ready for Thanksgiving, here are the candy yams. They have the Del Monte green beans, herb seasoned stuffing, and of course the crispy fried onions but we actually buy this sweet potato casserole from Aldi's that's absolutely delicious. So we don't need the yams right now. Brownie brittle. Let me grab one of those because I know everybody in the house likes it. So brownie brittle. brittle. Into the cart. Okay, here are some fresh avocados. I like a good guacamole. They're all rock hard, so I guess we'll take one and wait for them to ripen. Three items in the cart. Okay, I haven't made it to the deli section yet, but I wanted to show you guys these Philly Gourmet 100% pure beef sliced steaks. I bought them last time to make Philly cheesesteaks. They weren't good. So there's a little tip for you. I would stay away from those. Jamaican beef patties. Now they are delicious, but the spicy ones are incredibly spicy. So I think we're gonna go with the beefy cheese and hope that they aren't as spicy because my husband Alex loves them, but he can't handle the spice. Even for me, the spicy ones, I could do about a half. If I eat a full one, I definitely feel like it's bothering me. So I try not to overdo the spice. All right, let's grab a beefy cheese patty. Okay, items four and five are into the cart. I grabbed some avocado mash. Well, basically it's guacamole because this way I don't have to wait for the avocados to ripen to have guacamole. So we have that as well. I love nachos if you've seen some of my other videos. Now we're at the deli section and we're gonna go order the cold cuts. Hopefully they have the cracked pepper turkey that I want. Okay, we're gonna get some of the Dietz and Watson home style black pepper turkey breast some of the honey maple turkey breast, and some Genoa salami. 
We've added some Kleenex to the cart because Lord knows my family all have terrible seasonal allergies, which reminds me, I have to go get my shot this week. And here are the cold cuts, black pepper turkey, Genoa salami, honey maple turkey, and I also used the provolone cheese on my frozen French onion soup, but that's a whole other video. So I'll wind up vacuum sealing half of this. Of course, we need the naturally flavored seltzer, the winter edition of Polar Spring. I wanted to move that into the cart. The flavors in this variety 24 pack limited edition are black cherry vanilla, frosted boysenberry, pomegranate champagne, yuzu orange blossom, and blood orange cranberry. Naturally calorie free, which I love. So these are the slim cans, the winter edition. Have to get these. In fact, we made it a double. Why not? Now I'm on the hunt to find the Celsius drinks. I generally don't drink too many caffeinated things. I'm not a coffee drinker, but I do like the Celsius and it's only 10 calories. So when I feel like I want a little bit of a caffeine boost, although I'm not addicted, that's my go-to. So I'm gonna go try and track those down now. We found the Celsius drinks. They have the variety pack, but I've seen other variety packs with more flavors. This only has the kiwi guava and the orange, but quite frankly, I'm here and I want them. So I'm just gonna go with this one for now. Well, we've added a few more things to the cart. I'm quite confident we've broken the $150 barrier and then we're first going to have to come back in a couple of weeks to get the turkey after you clip the digital coupon. But they have this nice retreat pillow and I like watching TV in bed. So I figure why not give that a shot and we also took some band-aids. We got some allergy medicine for the kids that's down here. And I took some ultra soft lens wipes that I cleaned my camera and my phone with. So I'm quite confident we've made the $150 mark. Now I'm gonna hit the checkout. All right, we made well over $150 and I'm not surprised. We even stopped and put a few things back because we know that we have to come back to actually get the free turkey in a couple of weeks. But we did get the slip reminding us. So this was our BJ shopping for Thanksgiving or at least to get the free turkey. And we've accomplished that. I hope you enjoyed watching. Thanks so much. Please make sure to like this video and all of our other videos. Of course, smash that subscribe button and leave as many comments as you'd like because we love hearing from you. Thanks again. I'll see you all soon.